Hello. Is it streaming? Ah, there we go. Wicked. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode here on Fishing Balance. Hope everybody is doing well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So, in tonight's episode, we are playing about with the Hermes. Now, I love this. I've decided that I really, really love this boat. Now, this boat is, I've we got this boat in the last episode of the game. Sorry, I'm just getting me chat out so I can see what everyone. There we go. That's better. Wicked. So we have got the Hermes boat. We are living the stream. I in my last stream we had a bit of a play on it to see what it was all about. But tonight we're gonna go through it. We're gonna have a proper look at it and see what it's all about. And what am I going backwards for? There we go, we're going forwards. Wicked. That's, that's what we need. Okay, so let's get this show on the road. Now um, I don't know if I'd actually done a tour of this boat, but this is it. This is the bottom trawler boat. I really like this boat. This boat is proper, proper up my up my street. This is probably one of my favourite. And when it comes to the trawling, with my short experience of it last week, this is probably the easiest of the trawling boats that you can have. Though it all works very simple. Hi Jeff, how's it going? Good fishing. Thank you very much. So let's get our crew sorted and let's go do some trawling. There we go, that's bad. So set me troll bang two and three and oh yeah go on you can go out there. I suppose you can go out. There we go. Four we got four out. Hello dog mate, how's it going mate? I am going very well, thank you very much for asking. I got that first like in. Hello Felix, cheers mate, thanks for the like. Right, so we have got them in the set trawler and now, um, where is it again? Is that it? Oh god, I, I've got to try and remember where the thing is now. Am I at the wrong station? Why am I at that station? I'm meant to be at this station. Oh, that's what I've been doing wrong. Right, there we go. Drive from here. Ah, okay. that, that kind of makes sense. Not an open water. Oh. I'm pressing the wrong buttons here. There we go. Wicked. So, oh, what? Oh, that's the problem. It drifted outside. Oh, God. Right, so let's drift in to the open water and let's go hit it up and get some fishing done. Uh, it'll be a bit quicker. Now. So, how is everybody anyway? Everybody well? Da, da, da. Open water. Let's go. Oh, my uniform is amazing, isn't it? Look at that. I've got a captain's uniform on. I feel unique now. I feel special. Right, that's... Oh, uh, why do I keep pressing circle? Right, that's got my boat moving forward a bit. And then that's set the trawler. Why that's going in? I need to rest these guys. Oh no! Okay. All right. Okay, you can't move them yet. Wicked. So now the depth we are looking for is around about 183. That I found out last time when we were we were dabbling with the game. And this is what I got. Oh, I'm going too fast. There we go, Wicked. hopefully that will drop back in and we'll catch loads of fish. So in this game now we only got two, two different trophies left to get and then we pretty much got everything going. What's with the uniform and the new guy here? Ah uh, man, it, yeah, but it's, I love this uniform. This uniform is absolutely great, isn't it? Yeah. Me captain uniform. I feel like Captain Birdseye. 
This is the captain of your ship calling. Uh, I, I'm not gonna scare you all off quite yet with all with all my sad bad music. The 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 right. Let's get these fed up. Now, let's get them fed up so that they are ready because once you pull it in we are going to have a long night ahead of us with this game wicked okay so we're going to drop these lines out to about 183 meters you can see there with my db2 my dp2 and my dp we want them down to about 185 meters and then everything it will start pouring in a massive load of fish so we're going to keep our lines going out until we get there keep going here we go we've hit the 150 mark now this is quite a quick process as you can see there now we have already started hauling in fish so i'm going to stop lowering my lines there because these no, okay, not going to go up any further. No. Okay, not going to go out any further, so that's keeping going out. Out. Like, I wish you could just press the buttons in this game. Now, we've been playing this game for a little while now, and, uh, well, we've managed to progress through it really quickly, which is a bit of a shame. I wish it was just a bit slower. Uh, I don't know how many how many of you guys in here now actually uh, play the game a lot, but, yeah, everything seems to be going rather quickly, which, in some respects, is maybe... Oh, I can't put them out any further. I'm going to go way over my grades there we go as you can see there my depth is too much so that bring them in a wee bit that one's fine so we can stop that one and we can stop that one not perfect no there we go perfect I do but no I do, but I'm not at the trawlers yet, money-wise. Hello, Bob. Nice to see you, mate. How are you? Um, yeah, that's it, isn't it? it? It kind of feels like it goes a bit too quick, in my, in my opinion. Like, we've spent a bit of time, like, we used a lot of bank loans, paid off bank loans, and then every time that we got the new bank loan up, we paid off a bank loan, I then could buy the new bank loan and get the next trawler. It was kind of like, oh, okay. So, like, we have managed to progress through this in, in five episodes. Right, I, I, I'm slightly depressed by it because I was hoping I would be able to spend quite a lot of time playing this game. But it looks like this game, the series is almost coming to an end just because, like, it's going so quick. Rocking and rolling. I know this boat is like all over the place. Oh, hang on. Here you go. Oh, the waves have calmed down a little bit now. But um, but yeah. So I feel like they could have made it a bit more difficult to get bank loans or, or something along that line, just to make it a bit more difficult. Um, but of course it's it's kind of I suppose if they made it any slower, then it will go. Uh, it would work. Because like we've only got two trophies left to get as well. We've only got redfish trophy, and also I think it's the cod trophy left to get. So it's it's kind of like oh okay that's it. Work on my way to the Hermes. Well, but Hermes like um like this boat I've got to say is probably one of my favourites. Because like everything like it's it's quite easy like with the lunar bow it was quite hard to get to the point where he does <laughs> no i 100 percent agree with you there <laughs> there bob timmy does look a lot like oliver it's it's really like 
<laughs> and uh, sorry, it, for those of you who don't know, we're talking about Farmer's Dynasty here, but uh, but to me, is uh, I, I'm actually really disappointed. I'm not going to lie, I was really, really disappointed about it. Um, Timmy kind of looks like a strange version of Chucky, right? You know, the horror movie Chucky, because like, that, that, that boy looks creepy. And luckily, I'm out in my boat in the ocean, so he can't hear me back on the farm. But, um, yeah, he, he looks really weird. I would, if he was my baby, I would want to give him back because he just looks so creepy <laughs> so so creepy but hey I'm stuck with him um, I think Roga that Farmer's Dynasty is actually going to be chilling out and, uh, and hi Ronnie how are you <laughs> was that plowing your <laughs> nice smooth <laughs> I, I'm very well, thank you, Ronnie. Very well indeed. Thanks for asking, mate. Um, oh, my lines need to go out more. Sorry, guys. I, I, I was thinking, I was like reminiscing about Jimmy killing me in my sleep that I forgot to to actually concentrate on the fishing game. So. <laughs> so but yeah, he, he's really creepy, um, really creepy, and I was really disappointed in Tolfets for not putting more into action. Like, I, I jumped through the game really quickly, an accelerated time, just to, just to see what it was like to have Timmy. And, like, he's, he's really, the lack of interaction with him is quite a, is, is quite a, a, a disappointing thing. But hey, how... Like, but on Tuesday now we're gonna tr we're gonna stream a different game. It's called Real Farmer, and uh, it was like 34p. Uh, when you're out in open water, it's very hard to actually hit something. So, like, I don't need to stress too much about that. No, unless you hit the western wall, apparently. But I, I've never come anywhere near the western wall, so I should hopefully be all right. Oh, oh god I'm not I see I'm not concentrating again. So I'm gonna bring that one back up a bit. Bring him back within the two hundred at least. There you go. You can stay there. Wicked. Right, I need to haul in some fish. <laughs> whale. Oh I've tried to hit a whale, you just go straight through them. It's like they don't exist. Right. I know it's quite bad for me to say, like, could I have one that looks a bit more, well, <laughs> human? <laughs> because, um, I don't know if any of you have watched it, but have any of you watched um, the Jack Whitehall stand-up comedian where he takes his father to, like, Thailand? And, uh... And uh, they get they get that doll. They get that Chinese doll. I can't remember the name of the doll though. Um, oh my God, that's going to play in my head now. But he looks like one of those one of those Chinese dolls, and it, it's really really creepy. I really don't like it. Right. So how are we looking? Right, we're on 60%. We need more fish. Come on. Give me fish. So everything's looking good on here at the minute. I could try, let's see if we can get dropping down a bit more. Just to, there you go. Get them into this lower section of of the, my sonar. There we go, they're dropping down a bit. No, okay, I can't. That one stopped at the 200 mark, but why didn't my other one stop at the 200 mark? Uh, I'm gonna leave them there. Maybe Oliver, I mean you have better luck with the girl. <laughs> I'm afraid to get the girl. Because this is gonna be Chucky's bride, isn't it? We're gonna have Chucky and Chucky's bride. Now I think that's his nickname now. He, he's like he's a, definitely a Chucky in my eyes. So I've got uh, I'll have uh, Chucky and Chucky's bride.
but, but yeah but no I, I was seriously disappointing it and, and once I found out that I was like oh that's it I'm going to put the game to rest now until we get the content update here in the console and then we'll start season 3 but until then we're going to have a go at Real Farmer uh, which will be streaming next Tuesday I told you the super one I opened exactly and and that's it that's why I'm afraid to pay it, play it just because like he, he's really dodgy <laughs> really really dodgy right now if you want to give if you want to have nightmares just get a poster just get yourself a poster of that of that of that child stuck on your wall and you'll have nightmares for life right that's it if you want to keep your kid in the room or something just put, put a poster of that outside that bedroom door they'll never come out of that bedroom ever again no <laughs> but but hopefully like i don't know like i was speaking to gagor about it and he said that's that's the only interaction you have with that kid so uh, i'm a bit i'm really disappointed but hey hey that that's that's me Hi John, how are you sir? You have to stop touring, I don't want to be turned around. Are you in there? There we go. Yeah, okay. uh, what direction am I headed? I'm heading in a Westerly. And the Westerly is where apparently you have the problems. So we're going to try and fill this up. Now I'm hoping that I can fill this up. Now we're about to go over a nice hall so hopefully this will will max me up and then we can haul it in and reset it i'm gonna not gonna take this in the port now because uh, we've got a freeze on the hermes i'm gonna freeze all the fish excuse me i'm gonna freeze all the fish and we're gonna, not gonna go in until we're full because uh that's what i want i want a full boat and now i want to see how much i can earn if we have a full boat Come on, I just went through a nice section of fish there, that should... Really? You're not giving me any capacity for that? I swear the sonar is broken on this game. Like, anyone else play this on console? Or do you find that the sonar doesn't really... Doesn't really work? That fish... That one in... I think that would be my symmetry note. It's got to go out. Whoops. Oh. Because like, it should be filling up. Because my sonar guy, like, if you look at the boxes, the boxes are definitely inside that massive clump near the bottom. I'm, I'm not getting any fish in it. And this is the person. Oh, go on, get down there. Get down there, you beauties! No, it's not. It's not going anywhere. Come on, give me fish. Right, I suppose then that my first try in the Hermes last time round was was kind of like maybe a bit of luck. Yeah, that's it, is it? Like. If you look at the bottom of the sonar, I think that's what the sonar is meant to look like. But the top of it is all glitchy and, and horrible. It's actually really, really bad. So hopefully we get a patch to fix that at some point. But I suppose we'll have to... There we go. Uh, I've had big patches and no fishing on that. It's, it's, it's a bit, yeah. So it must be the sonar. There must be an issue with that. So at the minute, it's, it's essentially a game of blind man's bluff. You just gotta hope that you hit the fish. So I just keep heading in one direction and, and, and go for the fish. Eating big bacon cheeseburger and peanut butter pie for dessert. making me hungry oh john you're turning into the gaming gag or you, you're talking about food like i'm actually I, I don't know why but i'm hungry like every time someone comes in here and, and the second they start mentioning food 
that's it. I, I'm like, oh, I'm hungry. Have you shipped this little back to North Carolina yet? <laughs> Find him in the taxi truck. I did send him. I thought he's already, has he not arrived yet, Felix? I sent him FedEx. I really hope we, uh, he's my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> like I sent him a FedEx mate so I might bump into him stuck on an iceberg or something out here now. Maybe like a castaway moment. Wilson! Like he's all gonna be all grown up with a full blown moustache and his his uh this tiny little Chinese looking, well, not Chinese looking, but Chinese doll face. I gotta be careful how I say that, really, shouldn't I? I, I I'm, I'm sorry, I apologize. Right, come on, I need fish. Give me some more fish. I at least want to get up 60% before that. Now, look at that, there's, there's loads of fish by now, according to my sonar, but I'm nowhere near them. Is that you? You're an Ammonum. Silly girl. Right, so I'm just gonna sit here and... Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's gonna really, really, really... Oh, I'm nervous now. I'm gonna hear a knock on my door tomorrow. Right. He's gonna be, he's gonna be knocking on the door with a, with a, with a knife. Okay, how are you missing the fish? This is it. I, I believe the sonar is broken. Uh, everything is just pot luck on the console, by the feels of it and looks of it. The sonar is saying that I'm, I'm dragging through loads of fish here. Right. good shoot got to go have fun no problem at all mate thank you for dropping in bob and for everyone that's in the stream if you're ever looking for people to go and check out some other videos from other people make sure you go and check out people like bob slayer uh juice ms uh gaming gargoyle and uh everyone that's in my my friends of shared sheep on my main page make sure you go check out their videos and have a look i know bob slayer's got a really good um oh what is it What's the, what's the game you're playing? Oh man, I've been watching it. Why couldn't I not remember that? Uh, something of the Wild West, wasn't it? Per 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 per. Because yeah, you, you're playing a really cracking game. I have been following it and and watching a lot of them. Hold your own. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, so he's playing a really good Hold Your Own series at the minute. That's worth going to have a look at, folks. So uh, make sure you swing by that and have a look. Uh, really great game. It looks it's a, a nice little survival game. And uh, it's one of those... He's been filming it really well. And it's kind of inspired me to, to go back into the survival things. So who knows, I might have a dabble in a survival game next Thursday live stream. Or I'm looking for some players, to people that are on PS4 to maybe put together a series on a survival game. So if you are interested in that, uh, let me know and uh, I will definitely get something going. Uh, catch you later, sheep. Yeah, no problem, Raleigh. Thank you for dropping in, mate. Have a nice evening. But yeah, so we are going to cross through. And oh, oh, I'm fishing. We're going out. See, like there's nothing here. Uh, according to my sonar, 371 meters of the, of the nearest fish. And it's now randomly shot up. It, it's really random. The sonar is messed up. Completely kaput. Well, we're just going to let this trawl through. Now, I'm not going to change anything. Now, unfortunately, because the sonar is not looking too grand, I'm not going to bother even changing direction. But what, maybe what we'll do in a minute is pull it in. 
we'll see what happens when this clump goes past us. Because this clump goes past us and we get some fish, then fantastic. Then something is maybe a little bit right with it, but it doesn't look like it. So come on. I tell you what, what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave that trawl through for a minute. Let's have a little look see on the boat. Ah, uh, that, that. So, if you haven't got the Hermes yet, this is pretty much what you get. Uh, you've got your main navigation driving deck here. You've got some fancy little computers that you can't do much with there. Let's have a quick look at the front, which I'm not going to hit any iceberg. No, it doesn't look like it. And then this is the outer deck. Now this doesn't change, even when if you're not trawling, it all looks the same, which is maybe a bit of a shame. And so forth like that. But you can get to the front of the boat and do a Titanic reenactment if you wish. Um, just make sure you're not heading west because that's when you're going to hit the icebergs. I'm fine, Jack. Oh, wow. See, look at that. I'm right on that, on my port door. But, 168 meters, but I'm just, oh God. I, my bad, sorry. Sorry, boat, I forgot to steer yet. That's, that's my fault. Whoops. Note to south, do not get out of the driver's seat. <laughs> Is it going up? It's not even going up. Now yeah, we're bang on that. Right, okay, so we're going to go through this. We'll let this pass through the sauna and see if we actually catch anything with it. If not, we're going to reel it in and we're going to start. Get it all in, get the fish in, reset it and go again. Right, there's no point in me doing this because it seems like the first 40 to 60 percent are actually going to your boat really quick and really easy. And I've got a freezing capacity, I've got a freezing capabilities on this boat, so I don't mind actually uh, resetting them. I know my workers probably won't like it because they're going to get absolutely kaput, but hey ho, I don't care. Oh, it's going up. Yeah, we got some fish, baby. Go on. More fish. Ah, oh, you stop there. That's the pattern. I was hoping, I thought we, was, uh, we had it then. All right, okay. Record. So, let's get our crew. The... Let's bring them out. The, the, the. One last check on that. I should have left them in there a bit longer actually. Pull it. Pull it. Now we're just going to let this run through. Pull it right the way in. So we've got to wait for our DST, which is distance in meters away from the boat, gets to 25. Once it gets to 25 meters, we're living it up and we are then in the zone. Oh, my speed's dropped though. So let's get our speed back up a bit. Try and keep, I want to try and keep a better shape on it. So let's bring them in and hope that we can reset them really nicely. Just while we're waiting for that to come in, I hope everybody had is enjoying the farmers, uh, the farmers, the fishing balance sea series that we put that I put together. Uh, if you have, please don't forget to drop a like on the videos. And also, if you are new to the series, welcome, thank you for coming to join us. And uh, if you want to stay tuned for all the future live streams and videos that are uploaded, don't forget to subscribe.
Right, but the likes are the big thing at the minute. If you like, like the way that YouTube algorithm works is essentially the more likes you get, that it, people will enjoy the content, then it's more likely to pop up higher in the search menu. And so it's just a big like, uh, it's, it's a big thing to do. So likes really, really help me out and get my content out there. Right, so that's all this baby and we've got quite a well to go yet. 150 meters worth of hauling to do. Now I don't know if uh, any of you saw my last lunar bow haul in but I, I hit a glitch with that and I ended up pulling in two nets instead of the one net and uh, it like maxed my boat out. They came and maxed. I need to try and recreate it. Because if I can recreate that glitch, then I'm sure a lot of people will be interested in seeing that. If you haven't, if you try and figure out what I mean and you didn't see the last episode, then, then go back. I think it happens just after, it's pretty much my first haul. The, the thumbnail shows the two nets and you're hauling in and it's like, oh, I've got a full boat. And, I sold the whole boat for like 7 million in one haul, it was amazing. So I have a look at that and uh, I'll be intrigued if anyone else can recreate it, can recreate that glitch, because if that's the case then uh, people can make some quick easy money with that bad boy. So we're just going to carry on hauling it in, it's coming in nicely. Once these bad boys have come right in within 25, we're going to haul them in, get our workers to work in gutting them and stacking them and freezing them. And we're going to set our line straight back out and everyone's a winner. So hopefully that's going to happen pretty quick. 40, 39, yeah, we're coming in quite quick, so we should be alright. Click up in there. Okay. So I just had to plug my, there we go, 25 meters, so that's. There we go, we're hauling it in. So you don't really see much, you can't get behind the boat. There we go. There you can see my line coming in, it looks like a giant worm, doesn't it? That all comes in. Right, why that's coming in, that's start getting some... Ah, uh, there you go, weapon. You sir are going on the machine gun, along with you. You guys, oh no, yeah, no, no, rip it, no, 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 so now we only have one trophy left to get, which is the Redfish trophy. Which kind of like will be it then. Right, so before we put them to work, I'm going to put them on the sat trawler. And we're going to. Ah. There we go. Such all that. There we go. Weapon. Now, before we do that, we're going to check. Let's change direction. Yeah, let's go on a northerly direction this time. Come on, get round. And, and keep going, 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 keep going. 
and normally there we go let's drop our speed right back down to about there yeah there we go and that's set the trawler again while that's going out and leave them to it a minute Oh, I really hope that. No, I haven't lost those fish, that's right. Whew, I got a bit worried for a second there. I'm going too fast, there we go. The way that's going out, they're done there. So, do that. You can go over onto the, the freeze. Trees. And this is why I've got so many workers on the go. Trees. There we go. Just why I'm letting all that do. Wicked. Yeah, I know they say to have a minimum of like four people on your boat. But I, I've gone for seven just for the whole reason that I can multitask and get everything done a bit quicker, hopefully. But then hopefully before now I need to haul in my thing. I'll have them all gutted, frozen and stacked ready for the next load to go in. But somewhere along the lines then I'll have to give my workers a bit of a break otherwise they're going to be puffed out and I'm going to have a rebellion on my hand. A mutiny. And I'll lose my captain stripes. So we're going to keep them going out and see what we gain this time. Like I said, I want to try and stay out. Uh, if I can at least get that red fish trophy in the next hour, then I would have then got all the trophies for the game. And that's pretty much it until maybe if they bring out more content or or whatnot, because I know I, I know that they're bringing out the North Sea. Oh, there she goes. <coughs> So we have to see whether, when they've been at the North Sea to console and then we'll maybe come back into the game then. But I, I don't, once you've got all the trophies and you've got all the big boats, so you kind of don't see much more. Jimmy will be leading the meeting. <laughs> I actually wonder if one of my workers is called Timmy. I got to have a quick look. If, if one of them is called Timmy, that, that, that's it, I'm retiring now. Olav, Sander, George, Dan, Claire. Ooh, I'm lucky. None of them, none of them are called Timmy. Oh, shoot. Concentrate too much on that, I'm not enough on the... Not enough on the like the boat's rattling. I think that means that I'm actually too high. There you go. I do stop. Stop. And now my boat should be constantly filling up, according to my sonar, but it, it's really not. Uh, this one needs to come in a bit more. I'm doing this one. Ah! Du, 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 du. I'm going to take it up to 183, yeah? Because that's where I found my sweet spot last time. And my boat just... Just leave it there. What are you coming up more for? Stay. Right. There we go. My symmetry is good. My speed is good. My depth is good. It's still coming out. Right.
There you go. Wicked. So now we're just going to haul away. Or trawl away. Haul away, trawl away. You, you know what I mean. Right, I'm going to leave that for a few minutes. Let's check our workers, see how they're looking. They're crashing through that quite nicely. And we just got to wait. Oh. So. This is trawling. Now, it's very similar to like doing the whole. Um, that can go down a bit more. It's pretty much the same with a lot of the farmer games we play. Once you get going and, and everything like that, it's kind of not much else you can do. You just got to go with it and hope that you catch some fish. Yeah, right, that's going up again. Keep going. You beauty! Go, 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 go! Yeah, so there we go. So that is definitely a bit of a sweet spot there. I'm just in the 180 mark. Oh, okay, it stopped giving me fish now. Is it? Or is it giving me more? No, okay. Right, fine. Be temperamental. You just can't win with these games. But oh well. But yeah, so once we've achieved the redfish trophy in this game, like I'll probably hang fire a little bit on this. I do have another game that I want to start playing and I maybe do a few streams on. So, but of course, if any other people have like any re uh, requests for particular games to play, then uh, you can either speak now or forever hold your peace, or you can pop them in the in the comments box if you're watching this uh, stream on replay because I know a lot of people can't make all my streams but yeah so we're looking at other games uh, a game that I'm looking at and quite excited about is uh, Seven Days to Die I know it's quite an old game but I haven't played it and I've been watching a few videos on it and it's actually quite a it's quite an exciting game and something a bit different it's not farming it's not fishing it it's like do or die sort of game which is kind of nice sometimes and you get to do a bit of building and and whatnot like that but there's a we could play any game really people just want me to play a particular game and i'll happily play it Oh, excuse me. Right. So according to this, we're about to go through a nice bump on the port door. Which is the left side of my boat. So the question is, is it going to give me any fish? We'll find out in a second. We'll come back to that in a sec. Let's see how the workers are doing. They're looking good. Are we going to hit it? Come on. I want those fish. I need those fish. Give me money. So the main thing you've got to remember when you're doing this is uh, your whole spider. You want to keep your spider in a nice... I have all the dots within the green. Uh, ideally, I would want my symmetry a bit better. Uh, I could do that by either reeling one in or reeling one out but let's see what happened there I've my symmetry out no it's taking my symmetry in so let's lock that one off and let's take that one out look at that that is right through it this should fill my boat if this doesn't fill my boat out this is going to be really depressing There we go, my symmetry is a bit better there. Come on. Now both markers are going through the red side of it. So this should be like 
goal. Come on. I bet it's going to say nope, as survey says. Uh -uh. Sixty-four meters, ninety-four meters. It still hasn't moved. Come on. Gone. Does that mean I've got to load this back again? Yeah. And she's flying out. So that definitely me. I'm catching them. So maybe the sonar does work to a certain extent. I don't know. Come on, keep it going then. Keep filling me up. What are you giving me? Yeah, oh well. Okay, so if I move to 8 degrees. So if I move around 8 degrees, so I'll take it just the other side of north, should be about there, about there. Let's come back on the screen. Uh, I need to practice this so steering thing. Oh crap. Add more to the left. Come back around, don't I? Yeah. I've missed it now, haven't I? Ah, oh, silly me. But now my speed's gone. That's just silly, that is. I I'm keeping my speed. My speed, I didn't touch my speed, I literally just turned the ball. And uh, I figured out what it takes to be a YouTuber that you must be able to talk to yourself. <laughs> um, it's sometimes, yeah, it's uh, it's one of those things, isn't it? If um, like people are chatting, it's great, it's easy because then you can just interact with the people. But I suppose, like, if if you're on your own then then yeah you've got to be quite comfortable in in your own company and be able to to chat to yourself um but I, i'm i'm quite happy <laughs> chatting to myself I, <laughs> it's that bad in fact i'm quite happy to chat to myself and i can sit here for hours and and just talk to myself like today now like, this is what going to be my second video up today and uh, like that's it, isn't it? People are still listening, so like, there's still some people in the stream, so at the end of the day, I've got to keep chatting, otherwise it'll just be... Oh, God, I've, I've done it again, I've gone too fast. Yeah, just just chat to yourself, mate. Talk through what you're doing, what's going on, and... And to be fair, it, it, keeps, it keeps me interested as well. Right, so... Right, but it is nice when people chat to you right, and interact with you. <laughs> they have doctors that can help me. <laughs> I'm not sure about that, mate. <laughs> I, I don't think there's any cure for my problem. Uh, right, let's see what my workers are up to. Let's see if they've finished doing anything. Yes, they've finished gutting. Right, so now you guys, now you and Rasson, can go in to me stacking the um, the record. So now my fish are all going to be sorted and stacked, but I do need to get a break in into my 
into my workers at some point otherwise they're just going to be run down and, and, and depressed and then they're going to need a doctor to help them but I, but John, you should try it mate I think you'd be surprised have a go at just chatting to yourself while you're playing the game and just make sure there's no one present like I, I won't do it if my wife's awake because if my wife's awake she will be looking at me dodgy and I mean like what the hell are you doing uh, she'll be looking at me like a right tool come on then drop down again I want to drop them back down to around about the 180 mark they've, they've kind of creeped up it's probably because I, I, I put, increased my speed a bit and I want them back down there in that that sweet 180 mark that one's about right now two three there we go keep that one going out actually the symmetry is good so I'm going to leave them like that right, let's get that down fantastic we're looking good our symmetry is a bit shite but I suppose right, let's leave them like that a minute let's see how many work are doing They've almost finished freezing. It takes them a while to freeze, doesn't it? I need to get the fish in. Give me fish. My speed is gone again. I put more tad more speed. There we go, my speed is looking good. My depth is not too fantastic. Let's see if what happened if I drop that one a bit more. And drop that one. Let's get them down. 68. Right. So I'm looking at these two screens here. So 150 to 190 is a good depth to be playing at. Because then as you can see here, uh, there we go, so if you look on the sonar here, like apparently that's fish. Just where the tip of my middle finger is on the, on the thing there. Uh, apparently that line is fish, but I don't seem to be getting any of them. I'm just kind of like uh, trapped in there. My duck is coming up again. Like, oh well, there's nothing I can do about that, i just got to go with it. So I'm just going to leave it troll for a bit longer, just until my workers are sorted. Right, so... Still going through... Okay, where that we at? Let's recruit that again. That's oh, that's maximum length. Ah, there we go. How my workers looking? They've done that right. I'm gonna put these guys into rest for a bit. I'm going to feed them. I'm going to leave them guys on the stacking for a bit. Oh, you're going to give me some fish on that one. Come on, baby. Is that going to be any? No, it doesn't look like it has. Uh, I have actually, I've watched him do it on, um, oh god, 
Yeah, these these guys are nuts. But no, I, I have watched a couple of programs. I can't remember what they're called. It was a long time ago. But crikey, those guys are absolute nutters, aren't they? Like, I really can't get over how crazy those people are when they go out and they do it. And some of the conditions that they're working in, like, it's an absolutely insane. Oh, I haven't seen them have to fire off shots. I've only seen, like, the Scotland ones. Like, I haven't seen any ones of the actual Barents Sea or anything like that. Uh, I should have a try and find some actually just to just to see what it looks like actually on the balance sea because I know that they say that the weather and the map is actually pretty much identical to the balance sea but I, I can't confirm that because I have absolutely no idea um, but no that it, it looks like a pretty extreme life like and it's I don't know if they actually earn much money doing it. Like, I suppose uh, going out as a tourer, you, you probably earn a fair old couple of bob doing it. But doing it... But yeah, it, it looks a bit high risk game. Uh, you're relying quite heavily on a, a decent captain, aren't you? And uh, hopefully they never have a captain like me that, that can't do sh shavings. I, I, I can't even catch some basic fish in this, let alone in real life. No, but no, it, but then mind you, like, is it one of those things that you would uh, like to have a go at just, just once in your life, just so you can say, I've given it a go? I'm going to see if reducing my speed here just helps me out, drop these lines back down, I think I'm go down a bit more. My starboard line, which is going to be my right side of my boat, looks all right. I wonder if I could steer in so it's going to be right there. There we go. There we go. My starboard line is going through it at the minute. Please give me some fish. Come on, gang. Be nice. My speed has dropped down, so let's pump that up. Used to haul tugboat workers from the port. So everyone falls off, leave them. Just set them to the tow. Oh! Like, it's a massive risk, isn't it? Like, I can. I bet working on our tugboat was alright because you, you're not really going far out the port, are you? And uh, you literally just tow them in as they come in and stuff like that. Right? I can imagine that being quite a cool little job. Right? Yeah, I can imagine that being quite interesting. Right? I bet you get to meet some interesting characters that probably talk to themselves more than what I do. But. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, I can imagine it being pretty cool little, an interesting little life. Right, they're still falling. Those guys are arrested now, hopefully. But those guys have still got a lot of work to do. But oh, come on. Right, it looks like we've got a... 30 days at a time that's it isn't it can you imagine that spending 30 days non-stop staring and smelling fish like <laughs> whew that sounds pretty pretty extreme and pretty severe I don't mind me I'm just putting on oh there we go that's a bit better yeah, no, I can imagine that being, like, yeah, quite uh, an interesting... Hang on, why have I got lines coming in? That's saying it's 69 metres from... Oh, it's going back out again. What the hell is going on out there? Right, and can you imagine being a captain on it where you spend your whole 30 days staring... A screen like this, God, that would drive you insane, wouldn't it? 
are driving absolutely bonkers. Come on, give me this haul, push me over the 80 and then I can bring it in man. How are these workers looking up there? Uh, they're going quite slow with the stacking. But yeah, I bet some... Like, like that whole song, what do you do with a drunken sailor? I bet it's entirely because they did spend most of their time drunk just because there's just not going to be any other simulation oh excuse me any other stimulation outside of the boat well, and I bet seasickness I bet that would, no matter how experienced you are you're, you're going to be sick at some point with the rocking uh, yeah no, I don't think I could hack it I could probably go out for a day or two, like, because I'm quite good at talking to myself, as you, as you figured out, and uh, so, like, yeah, I could probably do that. Poor is life. So I got to jump out of here, and that bail to the left, just a tad. And let's see if we can catch this little. Oh, that's not that. Come on. There we go. Hopefully I can hit that. If I hit that now, I think I'm getting used to this whole turning business. But, come on. Come on. Yeah, I bet like these fishermen, they go out and they hope that they can fill up their boat really, really quickly just so they don't have to spend so long out in the... Yes, we got them. You're pushing me over the 80, are you? Yeah, boy. Nice. Quite happy with that. So, let's see how my workers are looking they're still doing that so I may as well wait five minutes and uh, I know I said they're out six months or so someone passed away I put in the freezer yeah like yeah they clear out all the ice cream don't they clear out the ice cream put the body in it and, and that's it No, it's, it's, it's brutal, really, really brutal. Ha, <laughs> beside the ice cream. Mm, mm, mm. Yep, is that strawberry flavoured ice cream or is it just covered in blood? Uh, you're never going to look at strawberry ice cream the same again, are you? Right, so that starboard is right, so let's go to the right a bit. Take it round to the right, there we go. Hopefully that's going to bring me in on to that. 37 degrees, so that's going to be around about Come on baby, turn. Going to be around about yeah. Now I just need to bring it around. Come on. I just hope now that my nuts pull around on that. Wait a bit more. Come on. I want to come out there, about there, yeah, that I do, I've seen a lot in my 57 years, but like, I can imagine like, especially working on the tugboat, I bet that's kind of like, you see a lot just doing that, 
hope it's gone under 41 degrees I'm not going to be able to reach it because that is round, 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 there but I don't know if my lines are going to pull round in time nah, I'm going to mess up oh well, I've tried yeah, I've messed up and now it's saying to pull back to 19 degrees so, oop, that pull back to the left 19 degrees which is going to be about uh, around about there I think but because the water isn't calm like it it's going to be quite difficult no, ok, right, army workers are going to have they packaged them for the way they have, fantastic so hopefully you guys are rested because you're going to go on the whole trawler uh, I'm really sorry I'm going to have to pick on one of you guys you because you're the highest level so I'm hoping you've got the best stamina and you guys can get a bit of a rest and a bit of food in you and I'm that do the rest first uh, haul in haul in just while I'm doing that then you guys can eat and I'm really sorry for me but he has got to do that one more so we're going to let all this come in actually what I might do is put you eating quickly and have some crumpets mate and hopefully they'll be he'll be fed before I get to the 25 meter mark keep dragging it in I've lost my speed I think I've lost my speed because I'm not falling Look at that line, that, that's gone up a bit more isn't it it's gone up past 80% well it's come up that is 70% now which is not bad to be fishing not playing slots <laughs> yeah that's essentially what I'm doing isn't it <laughs> I never thought of it like that but you're right that it is essentially just playing slots this game and it sounds like it as well didn't it beep I missed that where are we at 148 But I haven't hit the jackpot this time round. How much have I got on my boat? I've still got loads of space on my boat. There we are. 40... 141. Is that... I know, they're still resting and eating. That's fine. I let them rest and eat. Oh, but we're looking good. Yeah, baby, we're doing really well. And so this is pretty much the Hermes, folks. So if, if you haven't been out on the Hermes yet, and uh, that's what you're aiming towards or anything like that, then the, it's, it's as simple as like that. What happens if they refuse to work? Um, it says they're too tired to work and then they go into rest and you can't use them for a little while um, and that's the main reason that I'm keeping them keeping them fed 
because uh, if you keep them fed then then they're not too shabby and uh, they can actually work and, and do everything that you need them to do but it doesn't look like he's gonna any of them are gonna be ready for Uh, I'm going to bring you on that. Sorry mate, I do apologize. I know you don't want to be on the trawler, but I'm at the point where I need a trawler. Uh, 27, 26, 25, there we go. Yeah, we're in 25 meters, 20 meters now. Thank you. Now, what I think I'm probably going to do here now is uh, I'm going to get those three that have already rested straight onto the ice, onto the gutton. And then I'm going to let my other guys finish up a little bit and go from there. I need a dinghy a rod and reel. That, that, that would be nice. Do you know if they just added that little thing in where you could do the whole... Um, just basic seaside fishing uh, I think that would be pretty epic and it would definitely add a bit more than what's going on there it looks like an octopus leg is like coming into the boat or is it just me it does doesn't it Moby Dick eat your heart out and there we go Wicked, so what I'm going to do, let's set my workers at it. I'm not going to do another haul, so you guys are going to be doing two jobs this time just to keep the rotation up. And you, sir, can go back into rest for a bit. And then you two can come over on the freezing situation this time. So I'm alternating what they're doing just to give them all the experience and all the different things that they can do. Ah, oh, do you know what? Stop it. Come on, mate. Get in there. Get your job done. Wicked. There we go and uh, we have it I'm not going to reset the trawler I'm going to leave them do that um, but with that I think I'm not going to be setting another trawler in now um, just because my workers need to get on top of all of that business and whatnot like that so I think I'm pretty much going to call the stream there yeah. um, now I know what I'm I'm finishing about 15 minutes earlier but I can't see there's much more to do. Yeah, there's nothing else really I can do. I've just got to wait for them to work all of that. So, a bit of time. So, I'm going to call the stream there, guys. I hope you have enjoyed the stream. Um, it's been a short one, I know. But um, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please don't forget to drop the video a like. It gives it some massive help to me, as I explained in the, at the beginning of the video. And if you are new to the stream, thank you for coming in and joining in the stream. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to stay tuned for any future content that I release. But for now, folks, thanks for coming in. And uh, this is Captain Sheep signing out for the evening. Enjoy the rest of your evenings. Yep, have a nice evening, John. Thanks for coming in, mate. Uh, and thank you Jeff for coming in and leaving a like as well mate and I will speak to you all next Tuesday is my next live stream so I will speak to you all then but until then folks have a nice evening bye for now